Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. What I'd like to do is show you how to graph uh, this parabola um, using the kind of definition of a parabola. Now, using the definition of a parabola, what we want to do is first identify where is the axis symmetry. Is the axis symmetry vertical or is it going to be horizontal? And then where is the vertex? And then lastly, where is the focus? And the focus is going to tell us, you know, where is my parabola going to be open up to the right or to the left? So to identify all this information, uh, we need to look at our equation. And we know that, you know, from the basic idea of understanding quadratics, uh, from what we previously learned, whenever it had a vertical axis symmetry, we always said like x squared, right? Um, in this case, we have y squared, so that tells us that our axis symmetry is actually going to be a horizontal. And that also helps us when we have y squared that know that the equation of that parabola is going to be in this format. So this is the equation um, for a parabola when we have a horizontal axis of symmetry. You can see that right there. Now, when since we know we have a horizontal axis symmetry, we have our y squared, the next thing is to identify our vertex. And what's nice about this equation is that the vertex is in the form of h comma k. So looking at here, we see that I'm not subtracting anything by my x, so that's going to be, so my vertex is actually 0 comma opposite of 1, right? Ops, y opposite k, so y opposite negative 1, which would be a positive 1. So to graph my equation, I simply say, all right, so up one, 0, 1, so there's my vertex. Now I just need to do is determine, does my graph open up to the right or open up to the right, right? We know that the axis of symmetry is horizontal. And remember, the axis of symmetry has to go to the vertex. So that's why I know there's my axis of symmetry. Um, but where exactly, how does the graph open up? Now, to determine that, we know that the graph is going to open up in the direction of its focus. So if we can determine the focus, we're going to know where the graph opens to the right or to the left. So to do that, we need to determine the value of p. And what we notice is we have 4p times x. So it's pretty much negative 12 is equal to 4p. So I write the equation negative 12 is equal to 4p, divide by 4, divide by 4, negative 3 equals p. Now, to go ahead and so I have negative 3 equals p. Um, so therefore, the distance from the vertex to the focus is negative 3. Going along my axis of symmetry, negative would be to the left. So I go to the left, 1, 2, 3 units. And you could say that is now going to be my focus. So now, since I have my focus to the left, um, I know my parabola is going to be going over in this position. Now, we have my vertex. We have the focus, which is from my vertex, three units to the left. So I'll write in focus is negative 3, comma 1. The directrix is going to be perpendicular to the axis of symmetry and the same distance from the vertex to the focus as the vertex to the directrix. So to find my directrix, I need to go to the right, three units, and create a perpendicular line. And since it's a vertical line, x equals 3. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is how you graph a parabola, as well as identify your focus and your directrix. Thanks.